Praise the Lord, saints of God, body of Christ, bride of Christ. This is the prophetess of the Most Highest God. And today is November 8th, 2022. The Lord has been speaking to me a lot about Acts. And in my church, where I go and congregate, we're studying the book of Acts. Acts is a mighty and powerful book, brothers and sisters, body of Christ, body of Christ. We should be doing the acts that the apostles did in their day. We should be doing it even more powerful than they did. God said that he would put his power and authority in each and every one of us. Brothers and sisters, body of Christ, bride of Christ. It is urgent, urgent, urgent that we do what God has told us to do. In Acts 2.32 it says, This Jesus, sorry, This Jesus has God raised up, where we all are witnesses. Therefore, being the righteous hand of God exalted, and having received of the Father the promise of the Holy Ghost, he has shed forth this, which ye now see and hear. We have the Holy Spirit, brothers and sisters, body of Christ, bride of Christ. We must use his Spirit to do the things that we're supposed to be doing. He said, it, it's not by might nor by power, but by the Spirit of God. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. In Acts 2, P Peter is preaching to the crowd that gathered after the power of the Holy Spirit was, it was poured out on the disciples in the upper room. Sorry, brothers and sisters, body of Christ, bride of Christ. I have like a cold, <laughs> yeah, a virus that's going around here in Colorado. I caught it. Please pray for me. When those first believers received the Holy Spirit, their lives supernaturally changed. Supernaturally changed. That's what our lives are supposed to be, supernaturally changed. And the same thing happens to you and me, beloved. When you are empowered by the Holy Spirit, there will be a supernatural dimension in your life. Amen. Hallelujah. The Spirit of the Living God, the Rohakadash, makes us alive. He gives us revelation unto the heart of God. Did you hear that, brothers and sisters? revelation unto the heart of God so we can know him the Spirit of God will also give us supernatural boldness boldness that's what all of us need that boldness to go out and witness for God's honor and glory supernatural peace Supernatural joy. Supernatural revelation. God's Spirit imparts to us a supernatural ability to love, overcome, and prosper in every way, shape, or form. We are to prosper being the child of the King. In Hebrews, we all, we call the Holy Spirit, the Roha Kadesh, which means the breath of God. Did you know that it was called the breath of God? That's why when he gathered in that room with the apostles, he said, Receive the Holy Spirit. And he breathed the Holy Spirit unto them. There is no greater gift God could give than his own spirit. Amen. 
Hallelujah, praises, praises, praises unto my King, O kings and Lord of lords. Thank you, Jesus, for the Holy Spirit. Without the Holy Spirit, we would all be doomed, doomed, doomed in this world. Thank you, Holy God. Mighty are you, Abba, 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 Abba. Thank you, my blessed Redeemer, Holy Father. I thank you with all my heart, soul, mind, and spirit for the Holy Spirit. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Father God, for giving me your spirit, for empowering me and my family in Christ Jesus with the Rahakadash and making us full witnesses for you. I ask that you allow me to experience and allow my brethren to experience a supernatural touch of the Holy Spirit. Allow us, Father, I ask in your holy name, Jesus, use us to manifest your work, to manifest your miracles, signs, and wonders as you say in your words that we could do your glory here on earth. Let it shine in us, Father, for you call us the light of the world and the salt of the earth. Let us shine for your honor and your glory. Let our lights shine for your honor and glory, Father. I ask in your holy name, your will be done, Jesus. Not our will. Your will be done. Thank you, Almighty God. Help us all to do the acts of the apostles. Father, for we know that you are coming. You are coming, you are coming closer and closer and closer every day, Father. I can feel your mighty power and your spirit within me, all around me, above me, beside me. Father, you are here with us. Lord Jesus, let us do the calling you have placed upon us. I ask this in your holy name, Jesus. Amen and amen and amen. Brothers and sisters, body of Christ, bride of Christ. I pray this is a blessing unto you all. Shalom. Be blessed. Maranatha. We will see you in the air. If not up there, then again here. But I pray soon we will meet each other in the air. Be blessed.